viewers, this is Teacher Marvin. Today, I will be sharing something that probably a help with the day-to-day -day routine with our learners. Our goal is to meet the instructional needs of our diverse learners. Our classroom setting is always that heterogeneous, filled with the fast learners, the average learners, instruction for different needs, various educational backgrounds, some attention spans and interests, language abilities, and cultural backgrounds. Well, here is it. Differentiated instruction is a way of teaching. It's not a program or a package of worksheets. These ask teachers to know their students well so they can provide each one with experiences and tasks that will improve learning. This too gives learners multiple options in taking information. Differentiated instruction means also that we observe Understand differences and similarities among students. This can be associated with that of our learners' multiple intelligences, meaning that our learners will learn in their own learning styles. There are musically inclined students, preferably, they love music. smart or the interpersonal, and the self-centered ones. They are all our mission. The teachers, too, design lessons based on students' learning styles, group students by shared interest or topic, assess learners with formative assessment, and manage a conducive environment. According to some researches, teachers who employ differentiated instruction strategies will usually adjust the elements of the lesson from one group of students to another, so that those may need more time for a different teaching approach to grasp a concept, get the specialized assistance they need. While those students who have already mastered a concept can be assigned a different learning activity or move on to a new concept or a new lesson. There are also pros and cons of differentiated instruction. learning environment. First, we have the content. This deals 
about the levels of intellectual behavior, for it refers to the Bloom's taxonomy level of learning, the remembering, understanding, applying, analyzing, evaluating, and creating. Of course, we design activities for a group of students. of learning will have the remembering and understanding like vocabulary exercises synonyms and antonyms that pretty beautiful and dirty and clean or the simple ones for learners with some mastery levels will have the application and analysis for instance Describing objects, people, and events. Lastly, for students with high levels of mastery, we'll do the evaluating and creating, like constructing sentences and eventually a paragraph using descriptive words, having their own titles. So, differentiated instruction is obviously manifested. and learning is evident. The third one is the product. We have the tests, projects, and activities. This is what a particular student created at the end of the lesson to demonstrate the mastery of the content. with some animated aspects using the Movie Maker app. The second group will have the description pattern, or I call them the Earth TikTokers group. They're going to create a two-minute TikTok about the
the tapi. Nature's beauty, breath, look, and listen. For the third group, they will be using the comparison and contrast pattern. They are the intrapersonal ones. They will be composing a poem in free verse. With the tapi, the old me versus the new me. And for the fourth group, they will be employing two patterns, namely problem solution and persuasion. I call them also as math wizards. Being heartbroken is sometimes considered as a critical issue in our society, for it leads to crime and eventually death. This is caused by the I will never love again breakup, the love does not conquer all breakup, the I've met someone new breakup, the I like you so much it scares me breakup. And as wizards, they try to develop some formulas on how to escape or simply to overcome a heartache. But they are going to be sure that all of those formulas or steps are all convincing. and tell how it is helpful to them as a, as a student. That's it! All about differentiated instruction. As a sort of wrap-up, let me share to you these principles of differentiated instruction. The I informs 